Us consider ourselves lucky if a pop-up shower finds our house during the summer to cool things off. However, they've been rare across the Twin States. July 4th is known for its fireworks, but the dry ground could spell trouble. WCBI's Victoria Bailey joins us live in the studio to talk about that danger. Victoria? Joey, it seems almost un-American to celebrate the 4th without a barbecue or fireworks, but it's that one little spark that can create some big problems, and experts want to get out an early warning. Well, it's that time of year again. Families come out to spend time together and celebrate Independence Day, and most of those celebrations include fireworks. Right now, we have a Keech Byram drought index. Soaring temperatures and the lack of rain can be a hazardous mix when shooting fireworks. Some things that uh, people may not know is that these dry conditions that we are seeing right now, and even some of the uh, a lot of the area in a drought, at least a light drought, the ground. Is really dry, and so any little spark from some of these fireworks that uh, maybe some of the kids are playing with perhaps uh, can start a fire uh, pretty quickly given the uh, dry conditions that we already have in place. According to the Mississippi Forestry Commission, there were 47 fires due to dry conditions in the Golden Triangle last month. Forestry Commission Representative Temple Turner says families need to take an extra precaution, especially with such a high index. It's important, like I said, to be careful with your fireworks. Watch, make sure you're not shooting them close to dry grassy areas or dry leaves or other combustible materials. Um, soak the area down before you do it. And though temperatures continue to rise, meteorologist Williams says weather concerns for this weekend could be a lot worse. And the good news this weekend, it's not supposed to be overly windy because we see dry weather plus the windy conditions. That is really a good recipe for fire spreading. Usually wildfire peaks in the fall, and Mississippi has experienced 2,189 wildfires for the year, scorching 33,000 acres of land. So it is very important to stay cautious during these dry conditions. Joey?